Hello, I'm Daniel Soldano, Vice President of Precision PCB Services, Inc. And in this presentation, we're going to demonstrate how to install a BGA component using the Shuttlestar SV560 that also has the side view camera option. The side view camera will allow you to watch the solder balls reflow in the video screen so that you can ensure that you have a good reflow on the installations. So to start, I've already have our board in the fixture. We're just going to pull out our vision system. We want to make sure that our component is lined up inside the uh, pickup tube. And you can see our pickup tube is in blue here. And the component's right on center. So we'll close the camera. And we'll press our pickup command. Lift this up, we'll pull out our vision system, get it centered in the screen here. What we're going to do is we want to focus our solder balls into the screen. There we go. And we have a zoom, so we can zoom in if you like. Got our solder balls focused, our pads focused, and now we're just going to go and we're going to make sure that they're onto the pads. Make sure that all the rolls are on here. So I've got my top solder balls here. I want to make sure they're all going down straight. Slightly off here, so we're just going to turn the rotation a bit. Readjust our micrometers, go back up. So they're straight 100%, so we'll go back to the center of the uh, picture. I'm just going to line up our solder balls on our pads. Once I'm, co once I'm comfortable that the solder balls are lined up on the pads, I'll zoom out. Make sure that we're not off a roll, that they're on, on center 100%. And then we'll zoom out a little more. And I just want to make sure that my nozzle, which is also here, uh, the square blue outline, is centered. Okay, so we're ready to place our component. So what we'll do is we'll take our remote and we'll switch over to the side view camera. We'll put this camera in. Turn our side view camera light on. And we'll place, place the solder command. I'm going to go down and place the chip. And I'm going to watch on the video screen to make sure that the, uh, when it releases, that the chip doesn't move. Had a nice clean release. We can see our solder balls down here in this video screen. Okay, we can see it's start, starting to come up to reflow temperature right now. And there we go. They're all reflowed. As you can see, the chip is starting to move down closer to the board. So normally they'll out about 30 seconds after reflow. And then the machine will stop. Once the machine stops, it goes into automatic cool down mode. It takes about one to two minutes, and then you can start on your next component. That concludes our video for installing a BJ component with the Shuttlestar SV560 side view camera. Thank you for watching.